Hi everyone, it's Josh from Tall Toad Music again, coming at you from my little home studio here. Uh, today is just going to be a demonstration video because we're lucky enough to have three very cool vintage Gibson guitars. They're all small body, they're all mahogany and spruce. I have a 1943 LG2 Banner, which is this guy. And we're going to end up going from sort of the biggest guitar with the biggest neck to the smallest guitar with the smallest neck. And uh, I will do what I normally do, which is strum some, finger pick a little bit, maybe uh, give you a little idea just for the fun of it, what they all sound like. Um, so we're going to start out with the 43 banner. So it is in beautiful shape. And they call it the banner because it's got the only Gibson is good enough headstock. It has a, it's of course hard to see, but it's got a relatively sizable neck. Not the biggest you've played, but definitely bigger than either of these two. And bigger in general than a lot of the modern necks, quote unquote. This is a 14 fret to the body, and uh, here we go. I'll just uh, strum it. I don't have any real fancy mics going. I mean, I have nice mics, but one's pointed so I can talk to you, and one's maybe foot, foot and half away, pointed at the 12th fret. shadow a bit. This is a L-0, uh, so the body's a little bit smaller, the neck is also a tiny bit smaller, of course hard to see, but uh, definitely a tiny bit smaller. Mm -hmm. I'll lower that a little bit, yes. 14 fret to the body. comes this guy. So I'll kind of do the same similar thing. one L-00. So uh, again, mahogany and 
spruce. And the big difference with this one, the neck is definitely the smallest of the three. And it is 12 fret to the body instead of 14 fret to the body. So it's got a completely different voice. Less tension on the strings. These all have the same 12s on them. Okay, so here comes the 1931 L double octave. style that this thing definitely shines at. They kind of all do, but um, the 12th fret definitely gives it something. Three great guitars, three totally different voices. Uh, wow. Um, so anyways, hope you enjoyed it, at least just for a comparison's sake. Um, you know, we have a lot of vintage guitars that come through the store, so you never know what you're gonna find, but um, we get a lot, electric and acoustic, so um, keep checking the website and, uh, you know, come on in, because like I say, they always sound better in person. Um, lots of used guitars too that aren't in the vintage uh, classification, but lots of used and vintage guitars, and also, um, you know, full line of new Gibsons, Taylors, Martins, Seagulls, Eastman, tons of stuff. Check out the site, guys, and uh, hope you enjoyed it. Thanks.